Hi, everybody. I'm Leila Fouri, the CEO of the JSC. I wanted to just send you a personal event in the whole year for me. I'm incredibly excited about all of you joining the JSC um, and learning how to trade, learning about financial markets, learning about the companies that we have listed on the exchange. So I really encourage you, if you're not sure about whether to join, have a go. Join in and um, be part of the fun. Last year was an amazing, amazing experience. Um, I absolutely loved meeting with all the traders and all of, all of the people who took part won in a special uh, So way. we really are looking to encourage as many people as possible to jump in, experience the world of trading. You don't need any experience. You'll learn it on uh, all on the job. So we look forward to having you trading with us over the year. Thank you. As South Africa, we have a very low savings culture. So the JC is trying to promote a more financially literate society. The investment challenge is a competition that the JSC created where we help educate the youth in the country about investing on the stock market and the role that the stock market plays in the economy. I'm learning new things, the economy, how it functions. Even now on my phone, I have an app where I can trade. Every day, the market is going up and up and up and it never stops. But then, of course, there is that one day, it just gives you a lot of thoughts. So when the kids get educated and when they get to understand how the stock market works, they would get to know there are other avenues of investing other than putting your money into a bank account. I've already started investing. So far things are going good for me. We encourage that the students, whatever they learn, take it and go home. And if each one teaches one, we would not have this low rate of savings culture within South Africa. We are participating in the JSE Challenge. We are from Bumele Secondary School. Hello, we are the MP Unstoppable Winners. We are taking part in the JSE Challenge. This is 19. About the challenge is that it taught us about the economy of South Africa and many companies in South Africa. It also taught us how to make money through selling and buying shares. It gave us more knowledge about how financial literacy works and how the market works. I enjoyed working in groups and I enjoyed learning how it works, learning about people that trade and buy shares or sell shares in other companies. To interact with our kids and brainstorm ideas on one another and how to, to handle this agreement if you are working as a team. It will give you more knowledge on how to save money in the future so that you can, like if you have money, you can invest it instead of spending it and wasting it. I will say, when Sir uh, introduced this challenge to us, I didn't take it serious, but now it interesting. I, I started to like it. Uh, as maybe some people they may know, in the school it was our first time participating in this competition. We didn't know anything about the JSE, uh, but we have managed to work as a team because of two hands they are better than one. They were always hard at work trying to research, check different shares and I think we, we represented our school very well and we are not we are not representing only the school like we are also representing our province. Some of people think that trading is only for rich people. So this the JSE challenge provides us with knowledge to know that it is for everyone. Even us who can trade. I didn't know how to buy shares but now I know. In this country, um, we lack job, uh, so through this challenge, we can learn how to make money. It can make me financially stable in the future.
as we mentioned, 29,000 schools and university teams participated in the competition. So congratulations once again to everyone. We will start with the schools. Within the schools, there are four categories. The school's income portfolio, school's equity portfolio, school's speculator portfolio, and the school's ETF, ETN portfolio. So we have Buren Bonds II from Buren High School. Congratulations, gentlemen. We are now moving on to our top three in this portfolio. And in third place, we have money-making investors from Paul Ruiz Gymnasium. Well done, team. We now move on to the second place. And in second place, it is Turtle Traders from Paul Ruiz Gymnasium. Now we're down to our top three in the last school portfolio. And in third place, we have Stock Ops Trading from Islamia College. Well done. Just now we spoke about the importance of teachers and mentors, um, the role that they play is very important. <laughs> or for the subject advisors from the Department of Education. I would like to invite Mr. Masango to please join me on stage for the following. Now, these individuals have contributed the most this year in their province. Our first winner is Sean van der Waal from Uferbach Education District in the Western Cape. winner in this category is 
Leonetta Andrews from the Motheo District in the Free State. Come on, let's clap for her until she gets to the stage. <laughs> Thank you so much. Once again,